What's up, San Diego? My name's CJ Faison, and you are watching Faison Nation. Now, you're wondering, well, why does this guy have his shirt off? I just got out of the shower. I'm trying to keep this as raw and uncut for you guys. This is extremely possible, but today is day one of the Social Media Examiner Conference. Let me get dressed. Woo! All right, I'm dressed. I'm ready for the day, pretty much. I actually got to go run to the store and uh, grab a dress shirt. Uh, just wasn't feeling the attire today, so I'm just going to kind of switch it up. Got to do my hair still, guys and girls. But uh, other than that, I'm still here in my extremely small room. Thank you, Jamie. Bam, 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 bam. Got the boxers on the floor. I guess I got to pick them up, huh? So anyway, I just want to let you all know if today is the first day of the Social Media Examiner Conference. Why am I out here? Because I want to sharpen up on all of my social media skills and stay ahead of everybody around me, whether it's in business, personal, it doesn't matter, whatever it is. I'm here to do one or two things, actually two things. I'm here to grow this YouTube channel, but more importantly, I'm here to grow my business every single day, Delaware Auto Exchange and Motivated Eyewear. So uh, without any further ado, I'm hungry, guys. Again, this is—I feel like this is all I do on all these vlogs—is eat because that's uh, you know one of my most favorite things to do, actually. So let's eat. So I just picked up my badge, actually, from the social media conference, and um, it's still time to get something to eat. I, I skipped that, and I just figured I'd come right here and sign in and be done with it. But um, so now I'm actually headed to. Uh, I'm headed to the mall because, long story short, uh, I didn't really put this in yesterday's video, but um, the airlines lost my bag, one of my bags. I got one bag that had like normal street dress clothes, and then uh, the other bag had all of my business attire because I actually go from San Diego here. I fly to Las Vegas Friday. I have business meetings and some uh, videos I'm gonna film out there uh, Friday night, um, Saturday, Sunday, and into Monday. Tuesday and Wednesday is the car conference out there and uh, the airline lost my other bag so all of my business attire is like completely lost right now. So I'm just gonna go buy some from the mall and uh, be done with it. All right, so I just got me a uh, beautiful cinnamon pretzel actually. And um, so I'm gonna show you guys like out here in San Diego, they got some really cool stuff. Um, one of the really cool things that San Diego offers is this, uh, it's this, uh, I don't even know what to call it, it's like a scooter that you can ride. And basically like, hang on a second here. Damn, y'all are eating the pretzel with me. Mmm. That's good stuff, guys. Anyway, the scooter. The scooter. Let me tell you about that. It's like this thing where you scan the barcode on it, and it's like almost Uber, but you drive yourself on the scooter. So it's like a... Uber for scooters and Uber for like uh, just getting around like San Diego a hell of a lot easier because uh, you can get lost in here. It's like a big city type thing. It's like a clean New York City. So it's pretty cool. So guys, this has got to be one of the coolest things ever. I just checked into the Social Media Examiner Conference and uh, they've got these really cool things. Like they've got these bikes that you can rent and stuff like that. So this morning I actually downloaded the app and you can go and download it. It's called Bird. And uh, they invited me to come out here, check out what exactly all these are. It's really awesome, actually. So um, basically, right here, um, you scan that code right there. Alrighty, so I'm gonna go ahead. All you have to do is you gotta kickstart this thing three times. And then it's got uh, basically the handle right here. But uh, thank you to Bird for inviting me out here. And uh, I got transportation while I'm out here in San Diego just because of them. So that's pretty darn awesome if you ask me. It's a really, really neat thing. Um, but yeah, you just ride right around on it. And you can actually ride on the roads. I rode all this morning on the road. You know what I mean? Kind of rebelish, but is what it is, guys. All right, so we just got out of another, um, I guess you, I call it like a session. It's a session that I just got out of. But I'm actually here with Colby Ramey. And uh, he is from Bridgeport Speedway. He's the man in charge there. <laughs> That's gonna work out good. <laughs> so Colby and I are actually gonna go and uh, I, I made him download the app so that way he can get a scooter. I had to put my hoodie on. Shameless plug, DelawareAutoExchange.com. Go check that out. And if you guys wanna go, go to the link in my bio or whatever you wanna do, guys. Go to cjfacing.com forward slash shop. That's where you can buy all the merch from. I'm actually wearing a Face and Nation shirt under this. I don't know if y'all noticed that or not, but beautiful San Diego traffic that we're dealing with right now. Hopefully we don't get killed on these scooters. Yeah, see, there's multiple of them over there. We're good. Those are all, those are bikes, aren't they? Yeah, those are bikes, but that's where I parked my scooter at earlier. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So how are you feeling about uh, getting on the scooter for the first time? Uh, I'm a little nervous about the scooter thing. I, I would too. People in San Diego, they're not the nicest. Here, that's for sure. Not yeah. as bad as LA though. Uh, yeah, that's a good point. LA is slammed. Do not cross there? 
Well, what is that then? I'm walking. It's just a real pretty brick. Here, ready? Yeah. I'm walking. How would I cross anyway? He can yell at me. I don't care. Write me a ticket. Write us a ticket. And it says don't cross here, but you guys should probably hurry up and go. Oh, shit. Come on, Colby. What are you doing, man? We're about to get run over. Yeah, man. So we are uh, going to find us two of these scooters here. My mom always told me don't play on the train tracks. Well, here I am, Mom. Apparently, I'm supposed to be taking pictures of the gas lamp district because everybody else is taking pictures. So, there's my gas lamp picture. I hate following trends, guys. I really do. So, you remember where I am right now. If you understand the background, I'm literally sitting at the same seat I sat at last night and I'm back here again because the food was just that good, guys. It was freaking amazing. So, Colby. He wanted a steak, so I figured it's the best place to take him because it's the only place I've been here in San Diego. So we're gonna start eating. Dude, you're uh so oh, Colby's bag. <laughs> Colby left his bag on the $100 thing. Shirt in it's a hundred dollar shirt. So we just came out. Colby and I we actually rented these scooters right here. Again, shout out the bird. Thank you for even letting me be a part of your organization. This is pretty cool. But Colby left his damn bag on the freaking scooter. With a brand new polo. In it. Brand new polo in there. It's like a hundred dollar shirt. Completely left it in there. But anyway, guys, um, actually, that building right there, as you guys can see, that's actually my hotel. So therefore, we have a long scooter got, ride over there. You got a vlog but, uh, while you're on the scooter. Yeah, we're gonna vlog. I'm gonna vlog on the scooter for you guys. So I gotta get my uh, bird app back out. Look at you trying to light this up. Oh, sorry, bud. Gotta love it. Let me move my scooter. Yeah, let me. Uh... Yeah, first, uh, Colby actually, when he first got on this thing, actually forgot to put his damn kickstand up. So it was actually pretty funny because uh, all I heard was like scraping on the ground. I'm like, what the hell is that? And sure enough, it was Colby. All right, so Colby's over there. He's already, uh, he's already going off. Oh, holy shit, guys, that was a curb right there. I'm going by you. Thank you. <laughs> All right, so I am uh, officially on the scooter here. Colby, he's already way up there. He's way up there. But um, I'm trying to drive with one hand, it's really not working too, too hot. So. Guys, if you haven't already, go to cjfacing.com forward slash shop. Check out the merch. You're going to love it. I've been shipping orders out everywhere to UK, Philippines, United States, Canada, like wherever you can think of. You guys are really awesome. I do appreciate it so, so much. Um, again, big shout out to Bird. Go download that app. If you're ever in the San Diego area, you got to go check that out because you can literally rent this scooter. And uh, it's a pretty damn amazing process. So it's really cool. Cool. Huh? That was a long ride. What do you think, Colby? Oh, shit. <laughs> I think we need these at home. Yes. So Colby and I are actually going to buy some of these when we get back. Because, uh, as you guys know, he's busy around Bridgeport. I'm busy around the racetrack. We can have something to ride around on, you know what I mean? So, again, here's how you do this. Like, you hit the, uh, hit the lock button on the app. And then, did you continue it? Yeah. Okay, good. Thank goodness. Because you always have me walking around the whole city <laughs> looking for these things. Can I cuss? Can I... Yep, you sure oh, can. Okay. Yep, you can know. cuss. <laughs> so, um, when we first got them damn bird things, we didn't know to hit the continue button. And some jackass, not you guys, but somebody stole our birds. Those little scooter things. So they stole our scooter things. And, uh, yeah, it kind of made it. Oh, we don't want to go down. We don't want to go down. Yeah, they stole our scooter things because we didn't continue the ride. That's that's like the main thing. We had to walk the ride. two miles to get a new one. Yeah, we had to walk two miles. two miles. How's it going, man? You're on ground level. We are. Oh, we're not going down. We're going up right over here. <laughs> Go up. I got you. The whole point of the scooter is to travel efficiently. True. All right. Yep. So that's why we keep them. Got to yeah. keep them. Yeah. So actually, we are going to steal your scooter. That's what happened. They stole both our scooters. We pulled up at the mall and we just left them there. And then somebody like legit like came with the app, clicked it, and rode off with our scooters. They gone. 
Yeah, so we're actually going to party on an aircraft carrier. Like, legitimately an aircraft carrier, which is pretty damn cool in my opinion because I've never been even been on an aircraft carrier, much less partied on an aircraft carrier. And guess what, guys? Y'all are coming for the ride, so stay tuned. Look like we're Superman. You went into the phone booth. Alright, so we are, uh, we are all set here, Colby and I. We got the uh, rocket attire. I don't even know what you I really call this, but guys, check this out. This is my attire right here. I basically got a white t-shirt. I've got a blazer. I've got my cool watch. Business casual. Business casual. Business casual, baby. Let's roll. This is the, I'm a redneck and they're making me dress up. I like it. <laughs> so yeah, we're, uh, we are officially headed to the aircraft carrier to party it up. Maybe not party it up, but we're at least going to have fun. Where's my room key at? Hang on a second here. Guys, check it out. CJ Face and Delaware Auto Exchange. Shameless plug. DelawareAutoExchange.com. Anyway, guys and girls, we're headed downstairs now. We're going to have a good time. We're going to have uh, a really good time because I've never partied on an aircraft carrier before. Did you tell them about your hotel room? Oh, Did yes. They know room? that my hotel room is super small. <laughs> it's like living in a closet, man. CJ decided to get the European... Gosh. The freaking European... Is anybody else in here? Room. Is anybody else in here? Hello? Oh, we have no friends. No friends in here. So anyway, guys, I will. Uh, we're going to go get back on our scooters now, and I will update you when we get to the aircraft carrier. I like saying that. We're going to party on the aircraft carrier. That's How far cool. is the scooter ride? It's not far. It's like five don't, miles. Don't blame me. <laughs> I'm not. All right, so guys, so we're, we uh, have the official scooter parking right over here. And check this thing out. Like, this is just so massive. Guys, I don't even think like you guys can understand the multitude of this ship right now. It is absolutely massive. All right, I really don't know about any of y'all, but if you've ever partied on an aircraft carrier, comment below. I'm kind of stoked to say that I've officially done this. This is my clickbait for this video, and I'm letting you guys know that right now, that literally we are walking onto an aircraft carrier. Like, this is so sick. I'm gonna go all the way up to the top, Colby. All right, so Colby and I are actually gonna sneak onto the ship we're not supposed to go. <laughs> like, legit. We just came around this corner right here, and that guy is not paying any bit of attention. But we're gonna go down here now and just kind of explore around and see if there's anything down here. Look at all these wires, guys. This is crazy. Right now, we're just kind of like going through the bottom of this ship right here. I don't know, why would you? Look at all the wire. Yeah, that's not. I don't even know where we are right now, guys. Guys, I'm literally in here by myself right now. Colby, he's done like walk down that area right there, but look at this, guys. That makes me wish you could live multiple lives. Oh, me and you both, you man. You know what I mean? Like, starting yep. over when you're 18, you yep. go in the military, become an admiral, or something like this. This is How crazy. Cool would that feel? This would be awesome. Like, you're right, dude. If you could have two lives, I would most definitely want to be on this place, man. This is so cool. This thing is huge. Guys, I don't even think y'all can, like, fathom how big this ship really is. Like, Colby and I just took a tour of, like, pretty much, like, the, the Admiral's quarters and all that stuff. It's just crazy. It is absolutely insane. 
This whole adventure, man, is just. And all the planes fold up on their aircraft. I know. How crazy is that? They all, all the, fold up. All the wings on the helicopter fold up. Where's this one go? This goes to which one? There's like six of them. And we're back. I am back in my hotel room right now, and I had an amazing time. Being on an aircraft carrier was just like, it was crazy. Guys, it was so, so, so huge. Like, it was just. It was unbelievable. You can't even fathom how big this thing really was. I mean, this ship was just huge. And it's even crazier to think that they actually launched aircraft off of that aircraft carrier, which is so awesome. So um, it was really cool. You got to hear some of the, uh, from the veterans that are from around this area and some that actually served on that one vessel there. So that was really cool. Um, but, you know, I'm a huge supporter of the military and the police. I really do appreciate everything you all do. Um, it's incredible, man. You guys, the bravery that went on. I mean, that ship was uh, in service from the basically like the, the, I think it was like 48 or 49 all the way up till 1991 um, when it went out of commission. So that's just so crazy to think about, guys. But anyway, day three is coming up. This is day two in San Diego. And um, I got to go ahead and send my clothes down there to the uh, dry cleaner so they can get it all prepped and ready for tomorrow. Um, I've got even more clothes coming in that I had uh, basically um, upholstered or uh, tailored, I should say, tailored for me um, for the rest of my trip here since, you know, um, an airline, not going to say any names, but they fly south and they fly west, lost my luggage. So anyway, guys and girls, Good night. I love you all so much. I hope you all get a great night's sleep tonight, and uh, I will see you in the morning.